This is the second part, correction of errors, journal entry. In the first part, we rectified the trial balance. We prepared a corrected trial balance, okay? You know, correction of errors, it is a must on the question paper, okay? So you need to understand, you need to answer this question in your exam, okay? So here, uh, in the first part, we prepared this trial balance, okay? We had mistake one, two, three, four, five, six, seven mistakes we had, and we rectified and we corrected the trial balance, okay? So we have this balance, same balance. So this trial balance is here, balanced, okay? So then now we will check what was the mistake, okay? What is the journal entry to rectify the errors, okay? And later we have a, we have a suspense account $229 on the credit side and here we will prepare a suspense account okay we have this question from 2023 IGCC accounting past papers okay so here we have uh, three transactions okay Amadi then discovered the following errors that means after preparing this uh, trial balance he discovered these errors so here we see three errors the first one is here the general expenses account had been underclassed by $200, okay? So here general expenses, it is on the, on the trial balance, we see $6,430, okay? This, this account, this amount is here underclassed, okay? That means this $200 should be added with this amount, yeah? General expenses. So here it is $6,430. If we add more $200, it will be six thousand six hundred thirty dollar okay so general expenses it is a nominal account so what is the rule for nominal account when it is increased this account will be debited when decreased will be credited so here now as it is under cost by 200 this expense so now we have to increase okay so if we increase by 200 dollar the general expenses will be debited okay and what will be created? The suspense account here, 229. This suspense account will be credited, okay? So let us write here number first. One, we will write here general expenses to be debited and suspense account to be credited, okay? So here on the debit column, we'll write 200. And on the credit column, we will write $200, okay? So first one is done. Then here number two we have a rent payment $516 had been posted to the rent and rates account by $615. Okay. So $516 it is the correct amount, but mistakenly it is written $615. So here we see rent and rates, it is $7,380. Okay, that means here here we have the mistake. Okay. So the correct amount was 516. So here we'll write 516. And mistakenly, this amount is written as 615. So this is incorrect and this is the correct amount. So now what happened? Now here expense, the rent and rates expense is increased, okay? Now we need to decrease this amount, okay? So here, if we subtract what you get, we get here $90, okay? So this amount is added here with this rent and rates $7,380. So this amount has to be now decreased by $99. I told you already, when expense increase, expense will be debited. When it is decreased, it will be credited okay number two so here uh, the debit account will be suspense and we will decrease this expense so here it will be rent and rates account okay so here 99 dollar on the debit side and same amount on the credit side okay then here number three the totals for discount received in the cash book for February 2023, $165 had been debited to the drawings account. 
no other entry for this total had been made so here discount receipt 165 dollar had been debited to that drawings account okay so now what happened drawings are mistakenly debited to rectify drawings will be credited right simple okay and what about discount receipt discount receipt it is an income account you know income account accounts are always credit yeah credit accounts so discount receipt will be here also credited so what will be the debited so debit account will be here suspense okay so let us write here number three so drawings to be now credited because mistakenly it was debited so we will write here drawings so on the credit side we see 165 dollar and here discount received we know discount received an income account so income account side credit account so we will write here on the credit side again discount receipt so it is also 165 dollars so what will be the debit account here it is suspense account right so here suspense account will be the double 165 plus 165 equal to 330 dollars okay so this is how we need to rectify the errors so now here in this tutorial i did not show you how to write the narratives i have some other videos on this topic you can check out my channel i'll put the playlist on the description for your convenience okay great so here in our next tutorial the third one i'll show you how to prepare a suspense account okay the difference we see here on the trial balance 229 dollar so this amount how to place in a suspense account then how to write this there i will show you so that tutorial will be very important